Welcome to the February edition of the Smart Home Newscast, the only place to get your professional smart home industry news. We've just returned from ISE 2025, the world's largest electronics trade show, which this year saw a 15% increase in attendance, surpassing 85,000 unique visitors. And wow, did it feel busy. With a show of this scale, there were plenty of major industry announcements. So let's get straight to it. This week, we are covering the new smart home brand on the block, Motive, Lutron's RA3 release, Faraday's latest innovation, a new plastering profile, a sneak peek at the art of integration's stunning new demo facility, outdoor AV season is upon us, and finally, Crestron Home's new OS update. In the latest issue of Essential Install, Motive is described as the future of home automation. The company is making waves within the fully integrated smart home ecosystem, seamlessly uniting lighting, climate, security, and entertainment into a single intuitive platform. To find out more, we spoke with Motive's Director of Business Development, Guy. We are a Belgium company coming out of the electrical world. So Nico was the founding company, um, big electrical company. And if there is one thing typically about Belgium is that we are a complex country. Okay. Complex country on one side, but also on electrical level. We have 400 volt, we have one phase, we have three phase. Okay. We have quite a strong presence of electrical mobility, EV charging at home, yeah. solar panels. All this complex situation arrives at, at people, their houses. And what you see typically is that it concerns people. So we started a long time ago by really implementing into the architecture, the energy management part. And for us, energy management is two things. It's not only about saving money, yeah. making sure that you don't exceed a certain peak, that you keep your load balancing under control, but it's also about comfort, intuition. And that can be done in a very intuitive way on our application. Wow. So the app that we have, you can easily see, okay, what is my house consuming? What is being brought to the grid? What are my solar panels? Um, it's producing? a lovely display. The it's way it gives display. you feedback. It's a very easy way. Yeah. And you can give priorities to that. You can really say from, look, now my car is not priority. I have plenty of time. I have the whole weekend over. Ah. So I only want to charge on the sun. Yeah. So everything which is produced on top of your consumption goes immediately to your car. And that's in a very intuitive way. And it's also brought to our touchscreens. Just like said, people okay. don't want to worry about the amps and the kilowatts. Yeah. They just want to set priorities. And, and by opening up our system, by making APIs to the big smart home players, okay. we can bring it there. We can bring it to other systems like ah, Scooter okay. so and this, is, and this can be a back end for... It's not proprietary. We are really the back end. We are the infrastructure in the house and wow. we are open to, to accelerate and to bring that, that same information and intuitivity to, uh, to other players. First trainings are already at the beginning of Q2. So okay. we're on speed. Because like I said, we are big in Belgium. Yeah. We have 8,000 installers working with our system in the Belgian market. So the training facilities are ready. The people are ready. They only have to talk English instead of Dutch. That's the only thing we need to change. Okay. And then from there, are we reaching out to other markets? Yes. Main focus now is uh, currently Europe, the Middle East. Yeah. Um, but of course, we're expanding beyond. Um, we're quite new in the European market. Um, big player in the Belgian market, France, Netherlands. But outside of that, we are really expanding our... Uh, network of value-added partners and value-added distributors. It's time to reach out to Motive, get yourself certified, and deliver some exceptional energy management performance to your clients. It's as easy as that. Best conclusion ever. Another huge highlight at ISE was the launch of Lutron's RA3 smart lighting system into the EU and UK. So what does this mean to you as the integrator or homeowner? Well, RA3 sits between RA2 Select and Homeworks. Designed exclusively for professional integrators, it brings scalability. Supports up to 400 devices, making it ideal for mid to high-end projects. It includes the new Verti keypads designed with the UK and EU aesthetic in mind, available in polymer and premium metal finishes. And finally, Lutron Lamaris, a full color RGB tunable white LED tape unlocking dynamic customizable lighting is available within the RA3 platform. However, RA3 is only available to trained integrators. To install it, you'll need to complete a one day in-class training from one of these authorized distributors. So that's either Pulse, RGB Communications or Habitech. For the full breakdown, check out Essential Install's February edition page 20. Now on to Faraday. 
the experts in discrete home automation sensors. They've just launched a new plastering profile. And instead of me telling you about it, let's hear straight from Matthew at Faradite. Hey guys, Matt from Faradite here. We are so pleased to give you a quick introduction to our brand new motion sensor, 360 Plastering. The whole concept behind this sensor is making a sensor as discreet as we possibly can to make sure the architects and the interior designers on the project are happy to give the automation that us as integrators and designers want to see. So we have our pinhole sensors, we have our regular sensors, and quite often guys were trying to install the pinhole sensor in drywall ceiling. Now that's not designed for that. So what we did is we developed a brand new mount for our motion sensor range. Essentially you have the mounting plate here, which is a solid metal device with holes for plasterboard, centers for back boxes, so you can put it on an EU or a UK back box. We then redeveloped the actual technology insert unit. So this is available in KNX and dry contact output. That then goes into the mount like so. The disc that comes for the front is metal and it comes primed, ready to be painted to match the ceiling. That is held on with magnets, that slots in place. You then get a completely flush motion sensor solution. We've also added some IR blocking stickers that you can put behind this front plastic. So it doesn't affect the aesthetic of the sensor at all, but you can mask certain parts of the room so you don't pick people up. So it's great for kind of fine tuning the detection areas. It's available now in KNX and uh, dry contact output on our website. Find out more, head there or give us a call. Yet again, the Faraday team is smashing it out of the park with innovation. Next up, the multi award winning team our Art of Integration has unveiled a state-of-the-art demo showroom in Surrey. Let's hand over to Adam for an exclusive look inside. Hi everybody, I'm super excited to be able to welcome you to our new experience centre in Surrey. Please come in and have a look. Our new showroom in the heart of Surrey showcases some of the best products that we can find in home cinema and home automation. We've partnered with the guys of Lindorf Audio, not only for our cinema, but for our high fidelity audio. We've got Sonance invisible speakers for our multi-room solutions, and we've got conference and presentation facilities here. So we can deliver interactive presentations with our clients, architects, and interior designers. We've collaborated with our control partner, Control4, to provide a all-encompassing home automation system. From this touchscreen, we have the ability to be able to control our audio, lighting, heating, security, and our intercom solutions. The hallmark of our new experience center is our immersive home cinema. Come and have a look. Honestly, incredible space. I cannot wait for a full tour of the demo facility. This is going to be an incredible resource for integrators and clients alike. Spring is just around the corner, which means outdoor AV season is about to explode. Are you ready? If not, Essential Install has you covered with an entire feature, page 32 to 40, dedicated to outdoor entertainment solutions. From high performance speakers to massive outdoor displays, it's time to start prepping new revenue opportunities for your business. Highlights include the monitor audio speakers we featured a few months back, Marine AV from L Acoustics, and large former outdoor TVs from Proof Vision. Finally, we got the chance to go in depth on Crestron Home OS with Giorgio Galaris. Giorgio, what are the highlights of Home OS 4.5? Hi, I'm Georgia Galaris with Crestron Electronics here at IC 2025, and I wanted to share some of the biggest highlights coming to Crestron Home OS and our whole portfolio. Of course, many of you know Crush on Home OS, and we are always continuing to innovate on the platform with new updates. In 4.5, we're coming out. Here's a new one for you. Updated door lock drivers. So this will enable any CSP or any developer, anyone, quite frankly, to develop drivers uh, to bring all that compatibility of different door locks into Crestron Home. I'm not talking just unlock and lock, but that full functionality, including user pin codes. Now, we're gonna keep this fast and moving, so try to keep up with me as much as you can. Now, in user interfaces, we're always talking about how important it is, that connection between the system and the software. So, I gotta sneak in here real quick. 
that hardware needs to have that premium feel to reflect the quality. So this is our TSR 310. You're probably quite familiar with it, but you'll notice that we've recently refreshed the aesthetics with an updated metal ring here, larger button in the center, and we've changed the geometry just to help that muscle memory of when you're using the remote. We have also have a nice carbon fiber texture on the back that will uh, just make it a nice uh, little grip and we've released some awesome new firmware with the remote that really helps the functionality. I've spoken to many dealers here at the show. It was released a couple days ago, so it's brand new, and they have seen tremendous results. Not only do we have this in black, but we've recently come out with the white model. And this is in the TSR310, the HR310, along with our traditional vertical standing charging sta uh, station, and then a nice horizontal one so you could tuck your remote nicely in bed. Super exciting, and if you have a space for it, it is awesome. Let's move on to shading, right? While we may not have any brand new shading hardware to share with you today, we have a very exciting partnership with CI Systems and Shadow EMEA. What does this mean for you? You'll get the same quality of shades in uh, the hardware, the motors, it's all Crestron, but it's actually being shipped to the UK, the shades are being built in the UK, and this will take the lead times from six weeks, six to eight weeks roughly, down to 15 working days. This way, you can get those faster on the site and install and get paid, and really isn't that what it's all about. Uh, there is, of course, a dedicated fabric set for the EMEA market. This will take in consideration some local policies and styles, both for residential and commercial. It's super, super exciting. Speaking of super exciting, it's actually been quite crowded on this wall, but for lighting integration, both uh, in the UK, in EMEA, we have the new DIN DLI. This will bring uh, DM, uh, DMT8 into Crestron Home very, very seamlessly. We were always able to do that, but this just makes it a little bit easier. And of course, just to remind you all that Dolly 2, DMX, Philips Hue, almost all the lighting protocols could be brought into Crestron Home and controlled seamlessly with that continuous and consistent user experience. And before I leave you today, I would just like to share the major philosophy when it comes to Crestron Home and all of the platform that we develop. It's dedicated to that open ecosystem. Ultimately, we want to enable you to bring whatever the client wants in their home to a reality. And by having our ecosystem be open like that, we can support thousands and thousands of drivers and products to ensure that it is the perfect dream home for them and ultimate satisfaction. And they'll uh, get great word of mouth recommendations. So come on. If you'd like to learn more, visit us at crestronhome.com, visit our website, and get in touch with your local rep to learn more. Thank you. Crestron continues to push boundaries and I cannot wait to see how Home OS evolves throughout the year. We'll be beta testing 4.5 in March. So what is coming next month? Well, next month we'll be back for more industry highlights covering Lutron RA3 training. Yes, I'll be going back to the training room and learning about the new Lutron platform. We've got charity rides with the smart home community and as always, we'll be showcasing leading integrators. As always, this channel is powered by Essential Install Magazine and is dedicated to serving you, the professional smart home community. Want to be featured in our next episode? Send your press release to press at sunmedia.com. Check the description below for links to all our stories and upcoming training opportunities across the industry. That's it for this month and I'll see you next time.